I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to add and subtract military time in pre-algebra. Now with military time, it's actually relatively straightforward and related to standard time. The only thing you want to consider is that they think about things in a 24-hour um, range as opposed to things resetting themselves in standard time when we're talking about uh, things moving past 12 hours. I mean, here's an illustration. If you think about 1 p.m., for example, okay, military time will convert this to 1,300 hours, okay? So the idea here is things go past 12 o'clock. We do 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and then back to 12 again. But with military time, you want to think about everything goes from 0 to 23 hours and then 59 and then midnight, midnight 12 a.m., This goes to zero, zero, zero in military time. So when it comes to adding and subtracting military time, you want to keep this in mind. And also, of course, with standard clock arithmetic, if you are, if you have minutes greater than 60, you carry over to the next hour. And when you're subtracting minutes, you may need to borrow 60 additional minutes. So for example, if you have 13, 15, and let's just say you're adding 50 minutes, the idea here is you have 1365, but what you want to consider though is since you have more than 60 minutes here, you want to convert this to standard uh, rhythmic, uh, clock time. So this would be 1405, which corresponds to, this is military time, but this corresponds to 205 p.m regular uh, denoted time. Now, if you have 13, 15, and you're subtracting 50 minutes, okay, the uh, 13 hours and 15 minutes, subtracting 50 minutes, what you want to think about is borrow, because you can't subtract 50 minutes from 15, you want to borrow from this many hours. So you have 12, this becomes 75, so 12 hours and 75 minutes minus 50 minutes. So you're going to have 12 hours and 25 minutes left over. So when it comes to adding, subtracting military time, you want to consider the fact that you use any numbers from 0 to 23 and then borrow or carry over as needed if you have minutes other than higher than or less than 60. So it depends on what the situation happens to be. You should be good to go. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's how to add and subtract military time using pre-algebra.